so I'm out and about and we're doing another camera comparison test. On the left we have the Zenfone 6 and on the right we have the Google Pixel 3a. Now the resolutions we're currently shooting, front facing camera, 4k at 60 frames per second with the Zenfone and 1080p at 60 frames per second with the Google Pixel. So we are now shooting 4K at 60 frames per second on the Asus Zenfone 6. And on the Pixel, we are shooting 4K at 30 frames per second. Now the Asus has electronic image stabilization, but the Pixel has optical image stabilization. And on the screen, I can clearly see that the Pixel is smooth ultra smooth and steady and the Zenfone looks as if it doesn't even have stabilization so now we are shooting 4k at 30 frames per second on both cameras and as you can see the Zenfone is looking very smooth now and stable the stabilization on the Zenfone actually looks as good as the pixel which means image stabilization was not available early on on the Zenfone when we were shooting 4K 60. So you can see the colors are more enhanced, more vibrant on the Zenfone 6 and the Pixel as usual keeps it real and more lifelike. But which one do you guys prefer? Which one looks better to you guys? So now it's time to test out the greens in more detail. I'm actually very impressed with the stabilization on both cameras. We are shooting 4K 30 on both. Zenfone has EIS and Pixel has OIS. You can see clear AI enhancements of the Zenfone. Grass looks greener, sky looks bluer. It actually looks a lot better on the Zenfone. However, if we're talking about how it actually looks in real life, then the Pixel has captured that accurately. What do you guys think? Now I'll take you guys into another realm. This is the Honor 20 series event. A perfect low light situation with lots of colors to play with. So whilst we were waiting around for the launch, I decided to keep my cameras rolling. And you can see that both cameras have done a wonderful job, but which one do you prefer? After the event, I decided to go for a walk and I found an amazing Buddhist monument. So testing stabilization whilst walking up the stairs, both doing a great job. And the gold color is very vibrant and alive on the Zenfone. Awesome, awesome stuff. What do you guys think? So moving on to the photos, starting off with a stranger. Who is this guy? So Zenfone 48 megapixels and the Pixel 12.2 megapixels. Edge detection looks great on both. Slightly wider lens on the Pixel, but the Zenfone does also have a 13.3 megapixel wide lens option, but it's actually too wide to compare to the Pixel. So this was the best option. So photos do tell a different story. Whilst both look great, if we look at the sky, you will see the Pixel shows a bluer sky and it does appear to be more color accurate with more detail. And if we zoom in by 50%, you can see that both still retain quite a bit of detail but which one looks better to you? So more or less, every single photo shows more detail and clarity in the pixel. And a perfect example has to be this photo. You can see the leaves on the pixel shot are so much more detailed and vibrant when compared to the Zenfone shot. So now onto low light photos, and this is certainly an interesting shot. And the trend does seem to be the same throughout. Color accuracy always goes to the pixel, but in this shot specifically, I feel the Zenfone looks much better. It looks more vibrant and brighter with the colors really making the graphic come alive. So both devices are doing very well with low light photos, but which one would you say is better? So as we whiz through the last photos, I would like to say that phone cameras have come a long way, especially in the sub 500 pound price bracket. And the Pixel 3a costs only 399 and the Zenfone 6 is priced 499. And I do have to say, I'm very impressed with the camera capabilities of both devices. So that brings us to the ultimate low light test. 
Taking pictures in a completely dark room using the dedicated night modes on each camera. So this is a tough test. Not all cameras can perform well in this scenario and you can see that the Pixel is able to retain some of that detail and vibrancy and it's overall doing much better than the Zenfone in this dark room test. So there you have it guys, that was my camera comparison video between the Asus Zenfone 6 versus the Google Pixel 3a. Do let me know your thoughts in the description box below, which one you thought performed better. That's all for this video, thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a brilliant day. See you in the next one guys.